What does it look like for you to turn that energy and work on yourself? Not blame yourself, not be in shame, but instead of pressing things that you can't control. Is there anybody in this chat or listen to this right now can call the president and say, hey, this is what I want you to do about inflation. Change it right now to get changed tomorrow. So we're fussing about things we can't control. We can pray. We can vote. You know what I'm saying? Or maybe you can start a podcast and have a discussion about it or start a group or talk to a lobbyist. Maybe there's some things that you can do, but that will still take time in the in the midst of that time. What about you? Can you work on? So when everything turns around, you at your highest and best use to be effective and a game changer in this world. When the, when the tables turn, it can't stay this way forever. You know, when everything crashed in 07, 08, 09 housing industry, you know what I'm saying? It was it was at a height and then it crashed. If you look at history of economy, of the economy and the housing industry and all this in finance, it's, it's this. That's why you got to have multiple streams of income. That's why you got to have different your hands in different pots because it's like one will be low, high. Economy goes up, down. You know, it's nothing new under the sun. Work on yourself. Spend more time doing that instead of staring at what's going on on the news, man. We know people crazy. We know the world is crazy. It's a lot of tension going on. People getting beat up. People getting beat up in Canada. <laughs> it's okay to look at it for entertainment, but don't let it consume you. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know, doggone well, it's people that you know that's posting pictures of them being out of town and they live at home with their parents. You gotta let, just let people be great, man. Let them be great. Work on yourself. You know, it's people complaining all the time about people who left their life or left whatever's going on. Why'd they leave? I ain't never made one complaint on here about anybody that ever left my life. Somebody, if somebody leaves us for a reason, man, why not do the self work to figure out what that reason is? I'm too busy working on myself to be overly concerned about what's going on with somebody else, man. I got to fix me. I got, well, I can't fix me. I got to ask the God to reveal to me what I need to work on. And then some parts that I'm not smart enough to fix, God help me. Please, so that I can be effective in the kingdom to do what it is that I'm put on this earth to do. We only got a certain window of time. 